Well, it's the Children in Need Appeal Night tomorrow, and this week we've been showcasing some of the charities that receive funding. Today we're off to the London Borough of Sutton to meet two young carers. Wendy Harrell can tell us more. You good? Yeah. Yeah? You ready? Yeah. Sure? Yeah. Hold on. To see these two playing in the park, on, you couldn't know the eye-watering complexities of young Nicholas's medical needs. You couldn't believe the wearying bedtime routine involving medication and ventilation his older stepbrother helps with. It's sometimes been difficult, but some, it, most of the time it's like really nice. So you might not stop to think about the loving stoicism of this family who sought extra support only when the pandemic began, when none of them dared leave the house because of their youngest's health. So, Joey, what do you think schools could do to identify young carers? Sutton Carers Centre helped them then, and now Joey attends the Chill and Learn After School Club, funded entirely by children in need. I felt more relieved when I've come here and, like, changed because I know that I'm not the only one. Aisha also comes to Chill and Learn. Her favourite thing is colouring. She's nine and helps out with her brother. Uh, my brother uh, is autistic and um, sometimes uh, he doesn't have very good days at school. How do you know when he's had a bad day at school? Uh, because he makes a frowny face. Sometimes we play video games together and that makes him happy. Young lives transformed by children in need donations in South West London. Wendy Hurrell, BBC London.